Hello everyone, in this video we are going to test the speed of Opel GX and Chrome. We already know those two, probably before you enter this video, and we're gonna test the speed of those two, which is faster. But before that you have to make sure that you disable all your extension. I'm talking to myself. <laughs> the speed test will work perfectly i mean if extensions play uh, here the website probably will load uh, slower so you have to disable it and here in chrome it should be disabled too the test will be perfectly applied in this video i'm gonna use this uh, notepad here we're gonna test five uh, websites and also the speed test website so i'm gonna start with google i'm gonna test the speed of google and before that i'm gonna use incognito mode also the the cookies sometimes will slow down your load speed so probably this is uh, good to open the incognito mode so how, how am I gonna see the exact speed? I'm gonna do this. As you can see, there is a way to see your uh, speed without uh, using any extension that tells you how much it took to load this uh, web page. There is a way. When you click inspect element, you click inspect element here or you click control shift plus C. So this one appears. You have to go to network and here we can see the speed of our browser. Now I just reload my browser and I see it took like 1.26 seconds. This is probably accurate and if I reload again it's around that number. Before, it before that it was 1.26 and now it's uh, 1.19. Now we go to Google Chrome and in Google Chrome it's the same story so you go to inspect usually you just have to click F12 and it appears or you can right click and click inspect or even control shift plus E anyways we go to network again we will reload this page and uh, you have to use that as you can see it took 939 milliseconds which is lower than one second so i put uh here 800 it's uh, it hit the 800 so i think that google chrome is faster <laughs> when opening google so we give it a score of let's see here opera we give it a score of zero and chrome wins this round in the google.com uh, so we remove this one because we have done this now uh, by the way i'm not using the incognito mode so as you can see google.com i bet it's the same now we are in uh, the incognito mode let me reload real quick i see it's almost the same 900 1.2 900 anyways it can go uh, lower than 800 i told you probably it it's faster than the normal uh, one in the incognito mode it's faster yeah now we go to the next website that we want to test youtube.com and it says 3.3 we're gonna give it a 3.3 second 3.25 yeah you can say it's accurate now we test google chrome in the incognito mode and yeah 2.95 seconds 2.7 seconds so in this uh, one i think that now we go and see amazon.com 1.84 seconds 1.74 this is probably the best it can do 1.7 in my case i have uh, 20 megabyte speed in the internet now we go back to chrome Oh, that's nice, 900 milliseconds. So probably Amazon is faster than Google Chrome. So keep that in mind, please, if you are shopping every day. Anyways, it have here 8 milliseconds, almost uh, the same as Google.com. Uh, Google 
Anyways, this round I give it to Chrome. Chrome wins this, this round. And now it's testyahoo.com. Well, uh, you may ask me, why do you pick those uh, those websites? Because it's basically the most uh, popular. So in this uh, website, we see 3.2. Uh, we go to Yahoo here in Google Chrome and see how much it takes. This should do better. Oh, 2.9 seconds. That this one, that Chrome is better this time in this round. And uh, I, as far as I know, I can tell. I can tell that Chrome is faster. Let's see for the last one. The most boring website in the internet but it's a really helpful one wikipedia yeah i can see here three three hundred milliseconds three hundred two hundred seventy eight milliseconds wikipedia.org two hundred one hundred ninety five i can see i can tell that chrome is faster chrome is faster when we test those five popular websites but what about our last test? Our last test, if it beats, uh, I trust this website too much. And if uh, Opera beats uh, Google Chrome in this test, I'm gonna give Opera four, four points. And if Chrome wins, then yeah, the same here. I'm gonna give it four points and Chrome gonna be the winner. So yeah, I'm gonna test it. Firstly on Opera, let's start with you. And as you can see, this uh, website is interesting. It gives you a score of how much uh, the speed of your browser. So the higher the score, the better. Here we can see 700. Let's see if we can go any higher. 938.9, so it's 993 almost. Okay, we go, we go on uh, up. Okay, 907. So we're gonna take the last one, 941. And that's the score for Opera GX. Let's see for Chrome. Let's close this one really quick. Yeah, the first load uh, is not good. 929, 894, 910, 953. Oh, that's higher than OPLGX so far. Okay. I'm gonna be honest with you. Chrome wins the four points, which means Opera is slower than Chrome. And I am very sure about it. And uh, as you can see, yeah, I have the latest updates. Checking for updates, Opera is up to date. And uh, if we see here about Google Chrome, it's the latest. It's the latest version for this uh, date of today. August 3 uh, 31 so yeah I can tell and I'm sorry Opera GX you're slower than Google Chrome today's winner of the test speed is Google Chrome and let me know if you think that's uh, what you experience maybe there is some websites that we didn't test yet so please let me know everything and that's it for today that was the video of today if you want to see more videos like this one, please subscribe and follow my YouTube channel for more tech videos. That's what I do. And I'll see you in the next one.